So we, friends, today, we're the community of God. We're God's congregation. We are the ones who gather together in God's name and we affirm that we believe that God is God and that Jesus, His Son, is our Lord and Savior. That's our affirmation. And then we strengthen one another by our interrelationship with one another. We engage in what in the Greek term is koinonia or koinonia. We have sharing. The word actually means sharing. So fellowship actually means sharing. We are fellowshipping with one another and we're sharing with one another. So this is a shared process, a shared operation, and we need this exercise continually. So I want to say to you, there is no new thing, as Solomon said, no new thing under the sun. God is doing the same thing and has always wanted to do the same thing among His people that He's always done, and that is to bring us together as one community, and we recognize all of us as being fellow believers. I love that about the Jewish community. It doesn't matter what a Jew believes. Nobody who's a Jew says they're not a Jew. Okay? We should have the same attitude toward Christians. Everybody who names the name of Christ, we should recognize them as our fellow brothers and sisters in the community of faith and affirm them. But I believe that God is bringing about a restoration in our time and that God is restoring His church back to the foundational biblical models for our interaction and our relationship with one another. We are going to see more and more of the church coming together and meeting such as this for the purpose of studying God's Word together, for the purpose of having relationship and fellowship with one another, and for the purpose of worshiping with one another and praying with one another in the presence of God. And by so doing, we're going to get back to what it meant when Jesus said upon this foundation, the revelation of who Jesus Christ is, both Lord and Christ, that we have established the church, the community of Jesus Christ, and therein we can rejoice in the goodness of God in the land of the living. To Him be praise and glory forever. Amen and amen. Amen. amen.